Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Late last week, Microsoft rolled out their latest stable release for the Edge web browser for desktop, version 109. And I did post on that, and if interested, I'll leave a link to that in the description. Now, unfortunately, uh, according to a recent report by GHEX, for some users, after upgrading to version 109 of the Edge web browser, um, the uh, new version is affecting the printing from the actual browser uh, for some users. Now, at this stage, um, it's mainly affecting printing using special characters like umlauts. I think I've got that pronunciation right. And an umlaut, according to the online dictionary, um, is basically a mark used over a vowel to indicate a different vowel quality, and that's especially in the German language. So printing with special characters uh, for some users um, is causing issues after upgrading to version 109. Now apparently uh, quick printing and regular printing um, are both affected. And um, according to the report, uh, users have tried reinstalling uh, printed drivers, which at this stage is not resolving the issue. Now a temporary solution, according uh, to the report, would be uh, to uh, rename your printer. Now that might not work really um, to and be of benefit in environments like um, corporations and enterprises where um, you have uh, large networks and network printers and obviously changing the name of a printer um, the the computers attached to that network will then not see that printer so maybe that's not the best solution for large uh, business environments but if you are a home user and have a local printer connected then obviously changing that name may resolve the issue and apparently also using um, the shortcut control shift and p to open the system print dialog can also be a workaround at this stage because currently microsoft has not confirmed and acknowledged currently uh, this printer issue although uh, it is becoming more widespread and um, if anything does change when it comes to microsoft uh, giving us some more information or rolling out a fix or actually officially confirming the issue I will, like always, post and let you know accordingly. So um, if you are experiencing any printer issues, as mentioned, just try a couple of those solutions, especially if you are a home user. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.